This week, we see what it takes to own a cabin in the woods as we help our pals Eamon and Beck to get it winter ready. From chopping trees and moving furniture to diving for anchors and trying to shift a dock. Will this week convince us to move to Canada? Or will it all be too much for these Welsh kids? Oh, I'm putting on a claim. It was one time, Craig! <laughs> oh, knackered! <laughs> that was about to be the end of cabin life for Eamon and Beck. I think this vlog's about to get weird. <laughs> All right, so we're almost at the cabin. I can't wait to see the girls. It's been so long. Yeah, we did ask them to pick us up from the airport, but unfortunately they were a little bit too busy, but that, that's fine. That's fine. But the cabin is literally one of our favorite places in the world. It's so chilled. It's like Disneyland, isn't it? Yeah, it's just gonna be a great holiday. I've got my noodle to just spend some time on the lake. It's just gonna be so relaxing. Oh, there they are! are. Oh, so! <laughs> <laughs> Good to see Good. you! Oh, 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 oh. Been been so <laughs> Have you met also? <laughs> hey. Stay down. What's up, hey, man? Hey, 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 hey. Oh, I cannot wait to hang out, guys. It's gonna be so much fun. <laughs> fun. <laughs> yeah. yeah. No. No. You thought this was gonna be a holiday. We have a bit of a list we thought you guys could help with there. Big man list! Owning a cabin can be a lot of work, especially when winter's around the corner. What does this one do? What are those? All right, lads, by the end of the day, we'll get this nice and full. So we're gonna be taking down these two, this one, that one at the back. First job of the day, fuel for the fire. I am a trained professional in the chainsaw industry, so uh, if you are going to do this at home, safety first. And always stay hydrated. Tom. Tom. Really think this is a good idea? It's fine, just don't chop your leg off. Simba! Go on, Trevor! <laughs> I don't think it's gonna go. <laughs> I'll just I'll just finish it off. Oh, I'm knackered. <laughs> Where do you want it? All that needs to come into the processing area over here. Processing area. Yes, Craig. Oh, I thought, yes, Craig. How do we make firewood out of this now, Beck? Yeah, yeah, just use the wood splitter. Yeah, yeah, no worries. I've used one of these before. We're done. Can we come and play now? Not yet, Mr. Holmes. Let's get the porch screens up. Is this good? No, a bit over. More to the right. Job well done. Coming to you live from the deck. How many chairs did you want bringing out? Like one, two, over. Every single chair needs to come up to the top platform. Okay, over. Of course, we are only joking, as if Eamon and Beck would make us do all that on our own. We have actually been working as a team to get the cabin ready for winter. Also, we're packing it up because we're gonna do a little road trip with the guys in a few days. So if you haven't seen Eamon and Beck's channel before, they've had a bit of a wild ride this year. Beck was diagnosed with breast cancer and she's recently just completed chemotherapy and a whole round of radiotherapy as well. And she's been given the all clear. 
which is just incredible news. And the way that they've documented the whole journey is just really inspiring. It's a testament to both their mindsets. They're just so positive, they're go-getters, and they're just like, let's get this done. So to be able to come here now and celebrate with the guys, it's just such a good feeling. So guys, if you're watching this, we love you. If you haven't subscribed to their channel, they're off on some amazing adventures in the next few weeks and they've done some awesome stuff in the past. So make sure you head over and click subscribe. But for now, we've got a few more chores to do. Next up, cleaning the boat. Eamon's, uh, he's banned actually, because he keeps farting and it's going in all of our mouths and it's really disgusting. <laughs> I should actually walk at the back, I suppose. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's coming up wind at us. <laughs> Radio then. Eamon and I have to actually do some work now. Good boy, good boy. Yeah. <laughs> Amy's been acting like she cleans up a lot. I've never seen a hero before. Us is being really helpful. <laughs> Thanks, babe. Get a big boy. <laughs> Excuse me, when, boys? Keep rolling. Roll. This is a crucial job, Beck. <laughs> Keep rolling. Get the arrow. <laughs> I was just kind of thinking it'd be fun to join, eh, buddy? <laughs> you want to join the boys? That's good to get him Maybe out of Maybe king in it, coming 2025. <laughs> oh, imagine. What are you saying then, Trev? Life on the lake one day? Wouldn't it be special? Mm. It really is. It's such a great spot. We would love to move to Canada one day and get a cabin jet skis and everything. So much fun. This video gets 50,000 likes, they're gonna buy a cabin in the woods. <laughs> Yay! Let's go! Let's go! <laughs> so a few days ago, I actually got a really lovely DM from a girl called Amy, um, who we're just gonna go and meet now. She's got something extra special for me and I cannot wait to see it. We'd like to take a minute to thank this week's sponsor, Athletic Greens. <laughs> Girls, will you settle down? Janet, you will not be having another sleepover if you keep acting up like this. Oh, chill out, Mom. We're just young, healthy teenagers pumped on life. Oh, I just don't know where you get your energy from. We get it from AG1, Miss Patterson. Here, I'll make you some. Yeah, we all take it every day, Miss P. It's made from the highest quality ingredients, and it supports your digestion, aids in recovery, and best of all, it gives you energy. Woo! Packed with 75 vitamins and minerals that your body needs daily to help you feel more alive, Mum. Oh wow, I could feel young again. Oh my god, go on, Miss Patterson, you're like a hunk. Ah! <laughs> so go to athleticgreens.com forward slash king it for five free travel packs and a year's supply of vitamin D with your first purchase. I'm buzzing. You know how to drive one of these things? We shall give it a go. Where's the keys, bro? It's just a button. There you go. Put your seatbelt on, fella. <laughs> That's probably a good idea. Why is that not reversing? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, okay. easy. Easy on the gas, Trev. That was about to be the end of cabin life for Eamon and Beck. <laughs> Big hole in the side because of Captain B. So when I first got the DM, I was like, how does anybody even know me in Canada? And then my second feeling was like, God, this is so lovely. I kind of felt like a bit of a celebrity. I'm just really excited to show you guys what Amy's got. So nice. To you. I actually I made a hat for Oso. Oh my uh. god! <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. No, thank I you. Love I love it. I love yeah. it. That looks eggs, mate. Yeah. So good. <laughs> <laughs> I love Look at you with your new jacket, babe. <laughs> I know. It's made my whole year. It's so good. Canada's the best, man. Like every time we've come, we've met so many like lovely people. Mm -hmm. And it's just incredible. Like just doing this drive, the lakes and everything. It's just. We're definitely thinking about maybe shipping custard over next year to do a big Canadian trip. Yeah. So. Maybe do some cottage hunting. Comment down below if you would love to see that trip. If you don't want to see that trip, then don't comment. <laughs> <laughs> I got a present for you, Oso. Oh. Hopefully it fits your big head. Are you serious? <laughs> yeah. What is that? 
Oh, so. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Wait. Yes. Good boy. Oh my God! Yay! <laughs> yes, a good boy. <laughs> oh my God! You look oh, so, so good. you look so oh, good. <laughs> it's for the winter. <laughs> Pushy mama. I need you. <laughs> Looks like a little you. pumpkin. It's an eagle dress. I was just fashion. thinking about how Amy's such a legend for so many reasons, but the main one being the fact that you wear your wig all day. <laughs> as soon as we stopped filming, I was like, take this thing off. <laughs> and now she's got also in a headpiece. <laughs> The next thing on the agenda is to float the dock. <laughs> uh, Beck, you want to tell them about this? The thing is, Amy, I'm not exactly sure how to describe that better than we're floating the dock. <laughs> Basically, uh, our lake freezes over the winter, and so to avoid the dock cracking or crashing into the shoreline, we take it with an anchor and float it deeper into the lake. I love how you're saying we. They're like, Craig, do you want to go in the water? <laughs> Take a little towel down there, it'd be lovely. <laughs> so basically, somebody has to get in to begin with um, to move the anchor, he has to pull it up. So uh, we all boated and Craig lost. So he's going for a dip. We realized since spending time with the guys that Eamon doesn't always have a plan, but he's extremely creative and smart and we've all learned to put our faith in him and hopefully things will work out. Yes, so very much. you and I are standing, <laughs> if we, uh, like if I, <laughs> Even sit down, will you? <laughs> you know what? I've got an idea, actually. House dog. Okay, but house dog it is. Don't go too fast, back. You Don't drop it, Jeff. Ah! Yeah. Oh! <laughs> Goodness me. Okay, now this ramp has to go on top of this dock, and I'm the one filming, so um, I can't actually help. Oh. Go on, keep going. Back. Well done. Oh. A little bit. Oh. <laughs> So what's happening, Craig? I don't know what the plan is. Yeah, I'm just on the back of a seat here. <laughs> <laughs> what, what are we doing? Arm day, baby! Oh, oh, now the hard part. Does anyone else know what's going on? <laughs> we lost our leader. <laughs> right. Right. right! Is this right? Oh. Is this right? Oh. Yeah! yeah. yeah. It worked! We're away, lads! <laughs> Yeah, boy! Amazing! All right, buddy, you're up! I am the best swimmer. So I'm <laughs> the best swimmer. Are you got a plan? No. Get to work. I love you, Mum. One handed like a champ! Wow! One and done. Yeah! I'm putting in a claim. <laughs> what did you do? Bloody barnacles, mate. <laughs> this is drama. <laughs> we've made a little snack plate. Everyone's kind of celebrating because we finished all of the chores for today. Woo! Honestly, you guys, you've been such a huge help. I know. Thank I know. you so much. You're so incredible. <laughs> No, honest. No, I'll save it for the toast. Okay. Okay, because I was about to start crying, and I, just, <laughs> I don't need to start crying right now, do I? <laughs> I said, now keep in mind, we just cleaned the boat, so we should have brought slippers to go on it. Yep. Wipe your paws before you get on. Please. <laughs> so I've got to say, the best thing about coming up here to Canada to see the guys, to stay in their house, is these boat trips for me. This is probably one of my favorite things to do ever. Goodbye. <laughs> Welcome to uh, Craig Holmes cocktail making class. The first ingredient is um, missing. Um, so we've got lemons instead of limes. So what you need is a little plate to cut your lemons on or a cracker. And uh, what you want to do is just have a human hand right underneath the plate. <laughs> so much faith in you right now, Holmes. When the wind's blowing, you have to be really quick because it dries the glasses as well. 
It's hard to find the words to fully um, express my love and gratitude for these guys over the last year especially yeah I've just felt so loved and supported by them and I'm so grateful that they're here and they've chosen to spend all this time with us and fly all this way here bring us laughter and love and just fill our house with lots of great memories so cheers you guys love you both so love much you guys. thank you for everything you're Always, just the absolute man. best Oh, guys. guys, thank you, Bear. Cheers, Cheers. Cheers. It's a brilliant friendship. Yeah. Literally one sip. <laughs> Once the margaritas kicked in, we decided to play a game that turned into more of a therapy session. All right, let's fire it up. So for this part of the vlog, we are going to do a how well do you know your partner? <laughs> we did play this last night and everybody nearly broke up. So <laughs> it got aggressive. It turned so... into how much do you hate your partner? <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> what do you hate about them? <laughs> exactly. How well okay, I got one. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, who do I ask? Well, everybody, because the girl, how about the girls? We're answering the girls, like the girl. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Craig, I got a question for you. Ready? For Wait, me? What? Yeah, it's for you about I... Amy. Oh yeah. Right? You, How do well do you, for, know? you do it for you. The same thing? <laughs> I do it for you. I can't. Just cut me out of this. <laughs> <laughs> also, don't eat that. Why don't we do what annoys you the most about your partner? Amy, what would Craig say is the thing about you that annoys him the most? And I will answer it on behalf of Amy Perfect. about me. So. I'll be honest. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> not putting shit away. <laughs> when I don't put stuff away in the spot he wants it to go. Correct, winner. I'm not very good with technology, so he I ask for help a lot. No. 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 <laughs> we always call That's me a, a nan. Didn't we talk about this last night? That's the, yeah. <laughs> did we? <laughs> I told you the answer last night. Yeah, we did. What was the question? What was the answer? You're just really untidy. Oh, I honestly, this, I don't think I am though. Have you never told her that? Yeah, a million times. <laughs> She's in denial. It's not like, oh, I understand. Like, no, maybe not I'll even that. I'm, I'm like, a little bit shocked. Not See? because I'm it's like stage. not super untidy, See? but this is a classic defensive stage, Jenny. <laughs> Sounds like denial to me. Oh, have you ever? And we're back it? playing the game. Have you ever Should we break up? <laughs> <laughs> and now moving on to why do you hate your partner? <laughs> totally. Well, I just want to say, like, for the doc, like, I just love how much faith you guys have in me. Cause I'm like, yo, stand here. I'm gonna pull the entire dock away with the sea do and you're like, yep, no, we're standing right here. <laughs> so thank you both. I love that. No, Appreciate no, and that. once again. Oh baby, I know you. <laughs> I do that sort of crazy stuff. Oh all baby, the I know time. you're on for the ride. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. yeah you I just have to that. know that like, yeah. already. Yeah. Okay. Well, how did we do on that game? No. <laughs> <laughs> Is any of this gonna make it? I'm not sure. I feel like it's just been such a nice night. We've been itching to get over here for such a long time, obviously, since Beck has been diagnosed and we just wanted to get to them, to touch them, to hug them, to just be with them. You know, there's only so much support you can do from across the world. So now we're here. I'm so happy. I'm really, really happy that we've got to spend this time with them. And especially now Beck's had the all clear, like it's just the most perfect time to be able to spend time with our friends and It's just lovely, it really is. Hashtag blessed. <laughs> Got some black widow bites on her arm as well. So I'm going on TripAdvisor now, bed bugs in the cabin. Yeah, Don't come. Right. Don't, Don't fuck it. That's a classic spider. No, what? Yeah, five in a row. Like what kind of spider though? Like a big juicy one with a fat bum. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna need a band-aid on aisle three. Oh, we didn't start with limes, then we ran out of lemons. I'm pretty sure Eamon's making margaritas with oranges right now. Hey! <laughs> On a full on Italian night tonight. Yeah, Assemble! We've got cheese of all kinds. Mm -hmm. Loads of cheese, olives, more cheese, pepperoni stuff. So 
sometimes I just can't deal with like the language. I know. Yeah, and I have oregano. Oregano? That sounds so weird. Oregano. That is the correct way of saying it. Vote in the comments. It's gonna be such a good za. <laughs> such a good what? What? <laughs> I yelled over to Craig and I'm like, how's the za? And he's like, pardon? And I'm like, how's the za? <laughs> and he's looking at me like I'm crazy. What's the za? The pizza. Oh! Za! <laughs> Oh yeah. This kids is a shaped pizza. <laughs> <laughs> We've actually made two already. The second one was mine. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> it's in the bush now. It's, not. it's in the bin. It's in the bin. It can't go in the bush because it's bears and they might yeah, get it. I'm only joking, it's not in the bush. <laughs> I believe it was last year that Amy threw my pizza over the <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you did. Here we go, Trevor's masterpiece. Look at that, though. Wow. <laughs> Definitely the best looking pie of the night. What are you yeah, doing? Yeah, that does look good. I was just helping him with the light. Okay. <laughs> what a za. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Mm -mm. Okay, delicious. Where did you go to school? <laughs> <laughs> So lads, that is it for this week's video. It's been so good hanging with you guys again. Mm, it's been so too long. Good. It's been all right. <laughs> <laughs> so we've packed up the van and we're about to go on a road trip. Woohoo! So make sure you head over to Eamon and Beck's channel next week to see how we get along. Until next time. One, two, three, fight! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Girls, will you settle down? Janet, you will not. <laughs> Girls, will you settle down? Janet. <laughs> so say young, health, young, He's healthy teenagers. <laughs> well, they miss P. It helps miss you P. with me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. <laughs> For five free travel packs. <laughs> Fun. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. No, also. Oh, shit. Also. Out. I was just trying to eat the chainsaw. <laughs>